Coming up next, it's a light heavyweight matchup between Jean Vellante and Alir, the sledgehammer Latifi. Alir Latifi, as always, very well prepared and extremely focused and ready to go to battle. This guy is a very well-rounded fighter. He can do it all. If the fight takes place standing or on the ground, he's going to be comfortable in all areas of the game. Alir Latifi is set for tonight's fight. John Volante, as always, very well prepared, extremely focused, and ready to go to battle. This is a phenomenally well-rounded fighter, Mike. He's got really precise, dangerous striking, and if this goes to the ground, he's a great wrestler and has some slick, top-level jiu-jitsu skills. This is the prototype of the modern mixed martial artist. John Volante, back in the octagon here in Toronto, Ontario, Canada. Our tale of the tape for this light heavyweight fight. Latifi is two years his elder. Volante is five inches taller. He will have a three inch reach advantage. Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC light heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. Mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 12 wins, 4 losses, and 1 no contest. He stands 5 feet 9 inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Malmo, Sweden, Ilir, the Slant Hammer, Latifi! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 14 wins, 6 losses. He stands 6 feet 2 inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Melbourne, New York, John Malante. And with the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Levine. Eve Levine, our referee. You ready? You ready? Fight. Here we go. Tonight's fight is scheduled for three five-minute rounds. White trunks for Latifi. Black trunks for Volante. <laughs> That's Big a power solid that hook. hook. Hard straight punch. the single but doesn't get it clean hook volante with the kick to the body oh there beautiful combination he's fainting with that punch showing that punch hard hook a ton of quickness possessed by both of these men he's doing a good job of throwing punches and kicks from all angles here really doing a great job of mixing things up Volante counters with the left jab. He sees that coming and parries it away. And avoids the takedown attempt. He clipped him. Latifi with a strong combination. Oh! Boom, right on the oh. button. Oh, He's hurt! He's hurt! Nasty combination. 
submissions here. By Volante. She's gonna step right back over. Excellent posture here. And throws that right hand. He lands a huge elbow to the head. The TV's inside control again here. Under 90 seconds now. Trying to take the back here. It's got the hooks in. And he executed a very nice sweep here and wound up in guard. Go guys, work. Oh, he gets reversed. Great work from the bottom by Volante. Latifi's right eye is this. looking pretty swole. He's got the arm here. Now he's gonna throw his leg over. Turns the hips. He's gonna sit back. Throw the leg over the face. Great oh, submission gets. defense. He's got him in his guard. Looking for his back. Lands nice a hard left shot hand. with the left. Vicious shot to the body. Really good movement on the ground. Big punch. What a way to work at the finish of this round. All right, let's check out some of the action from that round. And here we see some beautiful submission offense here. Let's see if we get a better look at that from this angle. And let's take a look at that from a different camera. Good round, okay? You won that round by controlling your position on the ground. You need more of that. If you're on top, we need you to keep that scramble going. Do not let him off. The beautiful Carly. And we start round two. Now, starting off this round, you've got to think that the barrage that he endured in that last round is still affecting him. He's going to want to start this round off and move and avoid taking any damage. And he connects with the punch. Nice left, left kick to the body. He's able to avoid that big leg kick. Look at this. Fainting with that kick. Working the body. Man, Joe, he's connecting with those punches. Very nice. Look at how many body strikes he's landed. That's impressive. Nice, nice counter right hand. Oh, good shots. Big takedown. Good hammer fist. He's looking to take the back. Beautiful job defending the position. Nice. 
left hand. That swelling on his eyes is really starting to get bad. Joe, he's showcasing some great movement on the ground. Now he's working from north-south. Latifi gets back to side control. Move, move, move. Get yourself to the side. Scramble, scramble, scramble. Hey, scramble, get up. Go. Scramble, scramble, get up. Joe, three minutes remaining. He's looking to lock up that guillotine choke. Arm in guillotine here. Oh, he's got the choke. That's a deep choke. He might be forced to tap any second now. This guillotine is getting tighter and tighter. Oh, that's it. It is all over. Use great technique to get the choke and get the win. Time now for our fight replay. Let's take a look at the setup here. And here it is again, absolutely perfectly executed. And let's watch it here one more time. Deep submission and the tap. Here is Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Ian Levine's called a stop to this contest. At two minutes, 18 seconds of round number two. We find the winner by tap out. Clear Latifi, your winner by submission.